Nine people from the same family were killed in that crash tonight. We've got 429's Ify Ibosimba. She's live in Branson speaking to one of the two family members about what happened on the boat. Tia Coleman left her hospital bed to tell her story to the world. And today she says she's not sure why God spared her life. Oh. <laughs> I miss him, I miss him. A family vacation ending in tragedy. Since I've had a home, it's always been filled. It's always been filled with little feet and laughter. And my husband. I don't know, I'm going to do it. A tour boat carrying 29 passengers and two crew members sinking to the bottom of Table Rock Lake in Branson, Missouri. 17 people died, including Tia Coleman's husband and three kids. In all, she lost nine family members Thursday night. The harder I fought to get up to the top, I was getting pulled down. And I kept fighting and I kept fighting. And then I said, Lord, if I can't make it, there's no use in keeping me here. And so I just let go and I started floating. Tia says she thought her life was going to end at the bottom of the lake, but Good Samaritans were able to pull her to safety. Tia and one of her nephews, the only family members who made it out alive. They, um, before we left out, they just said, um, it's a storm coming, so go to the water first so you can avoid it. She says Ride the Ducks altered their tour that day because they knew meteorologists were forecasting bad weather. When they got to the lake, Tia says there was no sign of the incoming storm. But later, the National Transportation Safety Board tells us 73 mile per hour winds would whip the water, crashing six foot waves into the boat. Tia says no one was wearing a life jacket because the captain said they wouldn't need them. In Branson, Ifeibo Simba, 4029 News.